Alright guys, uh, today what I'm going to be showing you is how to um, get a virtual keyboard on your Palm Pre Plus. Okay, uh, this isn't much of a problem with a lot of the Palm Pre's, but a lot of people have had problems on the Pre Pluses, so um, I've got it on mine and I'm going to try to help you get it on yours. Now, uh, to start the video off, I'm going to be using an emulator to show you what to download just for recording purposes, it's a little easier and uh, um, and the uh, at the end of the recording I'm going to put in another recording of me using my actual Palm Pre Plus and uh, showing you that I've got virtual keyboard on it and that it's working and works well and all. Now this emulator that I'm using um, it is the emulator of a Palm Pre Plus, it's not a Palm Pre so um, it's, uh, it's made from the same type of phone that I have and um, you can download this by downloading Palm. Go to developer.palm.com if you want it. Just download their uh, their SDK and their PDK, and their SDK comes with the Palm emulator in it. You have to download VirtualBox too. But anyways, let's go ahead and get started. Um, go and open up Freeware, which you should have. If you don't, um, I've got another video in my uh, video files to. Uh, Teach you how to get freeware onto your Palm Pre Plus or Palm Pre. It's the same either way. Okay, once it opens, just uh, first things first, go to uh, go to patches and go to messaging. Now, a lot of people don't know this. Um, a lot of people can't get theirs to work because of this. But um, let's see, we're gonna find enable landscape messaging. You want to uh, install this. <coughs> One part of um, go ahead and go and restart. A part of uh, virtual keyboard is ran through uh, landscape messaging. You know that's a feature of it. And if you don't install landscape messaging, then um, you're keeping that feature from working. And all in all, it'll keep the whole thing from working. So just be sure to install that. Um, and you're gonna go back into freeware. And uh, once it comes up, you're just going to search virtual keyboard. You just type it up, type it in at the top. And here it is. You can read all this if you want. Um, anyways, here's just some screen captures of what it's going to look like. Uh, now you see this theme that's on it. If you have the Palm Pre, this theme is going to be, you know, changeable. You're going to be able to um, do different things with it. If you have the Palm Pre Plus, um, I haven't figured out how to change the theme of my virtual keyboard yet. Every time I try to change the theme or change the color of it, it um, it won't work anymore. So I've just given up on that. I think it's just something to do with the uh, Pre Plus. But yeah, you know, in, either way, you still have virtual keyboard. So just uh, install that, and uh, you see this package depends on one other package to be installed. You can either view what it is or install and update it. It's <coughs> a pretty big size file, so. Um, it's going to take you know, a minute or so to uh, download and install, but I'm going to go ahead and uh, end this part of the video, and uh, I'll see you on the actual on the live recording. All right, guys, this is the second part of the film, um, the part where I'm doing the live recording of my phone actually using. Um, uh, virtual keyboard as you can see I have a Palm Pre Plus you know, no, no button down here at the bottom just the, uh, the gesture area okay well it's going to be funny now but either way um, okay once you've installed the software um, you can go into your messaging app and uh, just not right in the middle because it'll take you off the page but 
try to do it you know more to the side just double tap real fast with your thumb and there you go and it's I mean it's pretty responsive to be on a phone that's not supposed to have a virtual keyboard um, Yeah, it didn't take just a minute to top that. And sorry if it's hard to see it, but I don't have my webcam's not the best. But uh, yeah, that's just I mean that's how you use it. It's pretty simple. Um, other things to it are uh, you know you can turn it sideways, and you can top that way. Not a big fan of sideways. You know the buttons are kind of spread out too far. Um, I'd rather top the regular way. You know, you've got all your little numbers here, just like on the regular um, uh, keyboard. But as you can see. Um, this was originally made for the Palm Prix and has been worked around to work for the Palm Prix Plus as well. Um, while I say that, as you can see, this orange button here um, for your symbol button. I mean, not just a symbol, but you know, your the background uh, selections on the Palm Prix Plus. This button is now white. On the Palm Prix, it used to be orange, like it is here. Um, you know, that's just a sign, but. Anyways, I uh, hope this video helps. Uh, comment, subscribe. If you uh, if you have any problems with it, uh, any questions, just um, I'll try to help as much as I can. Put your uh, questions or problems down in the bottom, or any comments on it, positive or negative. Put them down in the bottom, and uh, I'll try my best to help you out. And maybe other people who get this working that watch this video, um, they can try to help you out as well. Um, but. This is how you get it, and like I said, I hope it helps. Thanks, guys.